Final pitcher, where we're up for the last one, um, is Ritu Narayan, uh, founder of Zum. Zum? I'm Ritu Narayan, and this is my pitch. When my two kids started school, I no longer needed a full-time nanny. Yet, I couldn't find someone reliable to drive my kids from school to various activities. There are 31 million working mothers in US who face this challenge every single day. Zoom is solving this problem by providing on-demand rights and care by highly trusted and vetted network of childcare providers. Download our app and try Zoom today and share Zoom with your friends and families as we create the movement of Zoom to Zen. And share Zoom with your friends and families as we build. There are 31 million working <laughs>
Yeah, so we have a very high repeat rate. 90% of our families use us every week, and 40% of them use us every day. Uh, it is designed for as an everyday solution because the need is there for the families every single day. I was going to ask, how do you, I mean, I, we go through this too. Every week we, we uh, you know, find ourselves at the office or whatever, and we're arguing about who can leave to go do this and pick up the kids here. And, it, and I always think, oh, we meant to sign up for the thing. But every time I get ready to do it, I still have that, you know, my kids are 12 and 14. It's not like they're little, but I still do have a little bit of fear. And I wonder how do you see, how quickly do you see the market shifting and parents getting more and more comfortable with that as a concept? Uh, and I think the repeat person is obviously a huge part of it. It's very smart because I do think that goes after one of the pain points you have, right? Is That's that it's going to be a different person every time. So, but, but how big, I guess what I'm asking is, do you have a sense of how big the market is, i.e. how many parents really are willing and how quickly is that market growing? Yes, so uh, as you rightly pointed out, trust is the number one factor in this whole thing. Initially, we had to uh, coach your parents a lot, answer a lot of questions, but as our market grew, it's totally through the word of mouth because now parents can find other parents uh, using Zoom. And one of our key go-to market strategy is partnerships with schools, after-school programs, and uh, that's how we build trust because uh, schools are actually using us officially starting this school year. Uh, for their own transportation needs. And we are anchoring all the points of like, not just in the solution for the end consumer, but uh, for all the touch points to ensure that there is a trust in the system. I would really encourage you in your pitch to say that and to highlight trust. Because one of the things, you know, you have to remember, people really connect to brands on an emotional level, right? right? They, they want to get the who, what, why, where, but they're really going to go with you based on this emotional response. And trust is a very core emotion. And so I think you don't want to skip that. In your very short pitch, you want to say, we're different because we built a model that addresses the number one pain point in this business, which is trust by doing these things and list the schools. And I think that would really get to the heart of it very quickly f for people when they're listening to you. Yeah, you definitely hit a pain point that people, I think it, it's a great concept and thank you for that. Um, and I mean, doesn't everybody want a Mrs. Doubtfire with their kids? And, <laughs> but how, but I guess that's the question that I have is like, I'm just not quite clear on how are you sort of ensuring that the building of the trust is the, is the important piece, but how are you making sure and that you're getting the right person so that there is that consistency? I'm just not clear on how that's yes. working. So um, we have the full team doing the driver, or we call them Zoomer, recruitment process. Uh, it starts from actually... So, these are, so the Zoomers are actually um, Zoom's employees? Zoom, uh, Zoomers are our uh, network of co their uh, contractors. Like Ubers, they work on a flexible job. So like, sort of like Uber? Yes, simi okay. simi similar to that concept. Uh, but they go through a very extensive process in the sense uh, that there is a phone interview, there's a background a DMV record check, then they come personally into the office, there's a personal interview that happens, okay. and then there's a fingerprinting background check, which is F uh, FBI, and the Department of Justice level, they go through and on a very, uh, like one of our secret sources is a training, like how to handle kids trust on trust and safety. So by the time they're onboarded, they're just completely on that. And we ensure that all the people that are coming from uh, on a platform come from childcare experience. So a typical profile of people are either these are stay-at-home moms, nannies, part-time professional nurses, teachers, coaches. Uh, so already they have that bend of working with kids. Uh, is there and on top of it a selection process and training process completely ensures that this uh, they are brand ambassadors for the company right? yeah definitely right highlighting the zoomers is going to be really important in building that trust Absolutely. that process yes sounds really intense and that's exactly who people would want to know are taking care of their kids great okay. for two thank you thank you thank you